The Weeping Angels, probably the scariest Doctor Who monster ever. The question is, can they save the worst Doctor Who episodes? It's time to find out in this Halloween themed special. I asked you guys on Twitter what the worst ever Doctor Who episodes were. And the response was massive. Unfortunately, I couldn't pick all of them, so instead I've picked four that I thought would work the best. If you want to stay up to date with the channel, catch hints for future projects, as well as take part in community posts, then feel free to follow us on Twitter. For me, it's at the 42 and for Christopher, it's at CreativeChris37. On to the first story. Fear Her. This story is actually before Blink, but as the Doctor is already aware of them, it wouldn't have to be their first encounter with the Doctor. Fear Her is focused on a girl named Chloe Webber who draws random people and makes them disappear. But what if she didn't draw people? And instead, drew... Statues! The best part is, you wouldn't even have to get rid of the Isolus. But this time, when the pictures come to life, they would be weeping angels! In the time of angels, the doctor says that what holds an image of an angel becomes itself an angel. So does that also work for drawings? Maybe. This episode is set in the London 2012 Olympics. And the Weeping Angels are no strangers to the Olympics. In Good as Gold, a mini sword made by the Ashton Primary School, we see a Weeping Angel steal the Olympic torch. So they could also do that if they were in Fear Her. It kind of works, but most likely wouldn't work if this was the first time we saw the Weeping Angels. Night Terrors this episode is already quite scary, so the Weeping Angels shouldn't feel too out of place. This story is mainly set in a doll's house, with terrifying peg dolls. If the Weeping Angels were made of wood instead of stone, this would have been much easier. However, it turns out that stone doll houses do actually exist, and they look pretty similar to the wooden ones. So maybe even the house could be like a weeping angel. For example, the walls of the house could close in on innocent victims. Also, this scene where Amy is turned into a peg doll could be adapted easily. As we see Amy turn into a weeping angel in flesh and stone. Well, one thing's for sure, if they were in this episode, it would have definitely made it much scarier. The Idiot's Lantern. I actually don't mind this story, but in saying that, it would work really well as a Weeping Angel story. And here's how. For a start, in Blink, the Doctor made most conversation to Sally Sparrow through an old TV. And the villain of this story is a TV. The Doctor and Martha are sent back to 1969 which isn't that far off the Idiot's Lantern, which is set in 1953. But it was the villain of the episode that was the TV, so... In the time of Angels, Amy gets trapped in a room with a weeping angel on the screen, which then comes out of the TV as a projected weeping angel. And what if instead of losing their face, they turn into a statue like a weeping angel. In a previous video, we said that it may be based on Little Shop of Horrors, but with these new additions, it would be more like the horror film The Ring. Arachnid in the UK. Arachnophobes, I got ya. As the first thing you would need to get rid of is the giant spiders. And replace them with weeping angels. Also, it wouldn't be the first time we've seen the Weeping Angels in a hotel. Although it's very brief, we see the Weeping Angels appear in the God Complex. And they completely invaded Winter Key in The Angels Take Manhattan. There were many spiders, so you could have multiple Weeping Angels, maybe even throw in a couple of cherubs as well. 
The place would be covered in cobwebs, statues around every corner. Oh, and did I mention? The doors are locked! That's right, the Doctor would be stranded with one of the scariest Doctor Who villains ever. So that's it. Sure, the Weeping Angels would make the story scarier, but did they improve them? Please let me know what you think down in the comments below. If you're new, feel free to click the red button down below to join the adventure. I've been Lewis and you've been... Brilliant! So crazy passion and we wanted you to know So are you sitting comfortably? Our tribute to the show is If we had to choose another, we just wanna know